Brandon with Be Clean Professionals here. We are here on the kitchen cleaning. Um, as you can see, we have some dust to clean up. I have to take all the paper off. We have some tape residue we're going to tackle. Uh, the machines here. That's all. Taking all of these off here. In the refrigerator. Cleaning all of this off. Cleaning everything on the back end. Alright, right, stay tuned. So my team's tackling this back area here. There's an adhesive. Um, I seen this in the estimate when I was giving it, but I didn't notice it was this bad. This is not scraping off. This is attached to the surface. Now we can use a scraper and with a razor blade, but if you do this, it is going to damage the top surface and it'll be a smear on the, uh, on the on the stainless steel and they're brand new so i don't want to scrape the stainless steel um i have no other how to my knowledge there's no other way of getting this off um i don't i, I can't clean this i'm just going to be honest with you i can't i can't get this one done it looks like it's just been sitting for way too long and it's just not coming up i need to come up with a razor blade but i don't want to leave any marks and i can't i can't do any two more divots because it's going to leave a mark and it's going to damage the top surface. So it's so brittle, it's breaking off in, in strands. Dusted. Now the second part. Clean and polish. You can see the difference from here, it's from over there. Right here is the test spot. This is what we have to do.
You see there's some grease build up on here. Um, I put a degreaser on here, which is safe for this. Stainless steel, very important. And as you can see, some of the grease is running off. All right. But here's the main thing you want to see right here. That's a test area. It's a test area. So let's wait a minute and wait for it to work. And we're going to scrub this up. All right. There it is, all finished with the degreaser added. Tire cleaning, only one thing we couldn't get to is this here, which is underneath this oven, which is very heavy. And it is also hooked up. So we can't touch that. This gas line's already hooked up. I don't know if the gas is on or not yet, and I don't want to find out. So we're going to leave that as that. But of course, we're going to take all the lovely stickers out. Oh, we'll actually leave them in there for the for the crew. That way they know what the do's and the do nots of the uh, the oven. All right, stay tuned. Yeah, as you can see, we're under the hood. That's what it looked like before, right here. And this is what it's looking like after. Simply applying our spray and polishing it up. All right, stay tuned. Here's the second step of cleaning these grills here. And as you can see, there is a lot of sediment buildup. So we're using a steamer, placing them in the tub. And 
We still have two more left. All right, stay tuned. one and look at the difference that's what it looked like that's where it's at now we got all nine of those done there were ten all together and two hours later and we are about to be complete with just the uh these brakes here all right stay tuned as you can see we're on the outside doing the buffet table took all the plastic off now we're getting this tape and adhesive off using our um, polish. All right, taking these tape off. Stay All right, tight. we started at two o'clock and as you can see, it's eight o'clock now. So a few hours later and we are all complete and finished. Let's take a walk through and take a look here. Uh, we got all the refrigerators wiped and clean and polished. We got the side of this here. This had all grease build up on it. Even the knobs here. We got the hood up there, the whole way across. And uh, the second part up there as well, whole way across. We got up, up underneath here and on the side. There are fingerprints everywhere from people moving things around. This side here. All right, we're gonna come back, touch this wall up here. That's how we're doing the walkthrough. We'll touch that up there. Got all the appliances. This lovely pieces of equipment. This here. handprints everywhere got up top and we also did out here as well as you can see you're still finishing up removed all the plastic Wiped out the glass, wiping it down. There was some adhesive from the tape here. You can see, I'm gonna work and get that off here yet. Now, as you can see back here, we got everything wiped down and taken care of besides this adhesive tape. Um, the customer, their crew left this out sitting outside and the tape adhere to it so he's going to reach out to the manufacturer to see how we can get this off we tried peeling it off by hand and it just chips just it just chips in pieces it's it's not coming off so got that taken care of to the best of our ability same thing here all this is chipping we left it out in the sun of all the sinks. The bottom floor, this has been wiped. And we cleaned the vents here. If you see in the video, there's 10 of these. All these grates in the middle are all cleaned out. They were all gunked up, just like, looked like that down at the bottom. And as you can see, they're all cleaned up now. And like I said, there's 10 of them. All right, so that concludes the cleaning um, of the kitchen area. Like I said, we got the sinks as well. Just to preview that. Everything's thing's been shined and polished. All right, stay tuned for the next cleaning.